Okay, so the engine is now a little bit rebuilt. Uh, you can see here that the valve train is operated by gears. And we have uh, the uh, speed computer is run by this 8 tooth gear, which is then which then runs this 24 tooth gears uh, gear. So uh, the speed reduction is uh, uh, three to one. So uh, whatever reading we get here, this is from the previous run. Uh, you have to multiply by three. This is so we can read above 4000 RPMs. As you can see here, the number is very encouraging. Now let's see uh, the sound. Oh, come on. Okay, so let, let me play with the timings now and let's see if we can improve this a little bit. Let's see what happens now. Okay, so I'm pretty happy with this. Uh, the engine is strong. Uh, if this is to be believed, it runs almost 5000 RPMs ish. Uh, I'm not sure how accurate uh, this reading is. Uh, but uh, we do have a leak. Uh, you may not see it, but here on this uh, junction, uh, uh, there was foam uh, so here uh, air is getting out maybe the t-piece is broken I don't know I will replace this and try it again uh, maybe not in a video but uh, there will be a video of this engine in the car next uh, as I can see nothing is worn which is good. Uh, yep, everything is fine. So this and this engine is ready to be installed into the E30. So I see you soon.